Gate 3, wake up Maggie. And they're off. And one of the best into stride, Gormley Girl. And my goodness me, the favourite caught in Courtney stood there, missed the start by about 10 lengths. And if you took one to two, you're going to be worried because this horse is distanced behind the entire field. We'll have to see if that horse was given a fair start and is swishing the tail and doesn't even want to take part from the looks of it. Halo Star onto the course proper in front. A neck to Nadia business and two lengths away sharing third, Gormley Girl and Absolute Jewel on the inside. The other pair, Little Fire and Wake Up Maggie and Courtney Courtney has pulled out the race altogether. So that is a disaster for favourite supporters. Racing out in front, Halo Style and Nadia Business share the lead by two lengths. They're absolutely in pairs here. Absolute Jewel on the inside of Gormley Girl. A length and a half to wake up Maggie creeping closer and on the outside pushed along as Little Fire. The first quarter was 23 and 4. Halo Style trying to go gate to wire today. Leads a long neck to Nadia Business. Pushed along as Absolute Jewel two away making ground. Gormley Girl under the whip. Then wake up Maggie and Little Fire. They come down to the final quarter. Halo Style's lead about a half a length to three quarters of Nadia business. Absolute Jewel in third. Halo Style turns in front. Then Gormley Girl wake up Maggie and Little Fire. Getting away Halo Style by two lengths to Nadia Business. Absolute Jewel. The others need to get a wriggle on here. Out in front. Halo Style holding safely at the moment. They go inside the final furlong. Halo Style two in front. Nadia Business coming back on on the outside. It is Halo Style by a length and a half to Nadia Business. And what a great ride. Rico Walcott. Halo Style gate to wire by a length. Nadia Business second, Gormley Girl third, then Absolute Jewel, followed by Little Fire and Wake Up Maggie. More to come on the five, time 125.85. Stewards have opened an inquiry into the start involving the five, courting Courtney to see if this horse was in fact given a... Nice win, Halo style and well over the odds for Colebrook Farms. Patrick Dixon, a great gate to wire win and Rico Walcott, a tremendous all the way on the lead victory. A four-year-old Bay Philly, she's by a measle.